Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm here to present you an issue going on with the NVIDIA's Maxwell architecture from the latest 900 series G4 GTX 970 graphics card. So basically the problem is with the VRAM of the 970. From the 4GB of VRAM it is only 3.5GB. That is a very sad thing to see this. A new card with this issue. So basically in this video I'm going to show you the full fact of this issue with some examples too so that you can understand so even you have already seen this issue video on youtube but over here to make you understand more briefly i will show you with the examples too so this card was basically released on 19 of september 2014 with massive specification they have showed comparing to the geforce 980 which was released in the same date also with a price point of $329 that was $970 and $980 was around $549. Both card difference was only the boost clock, memory bus, white cores, DMUS which means the texturing mapping unit, ROPS which is the rendering output unit. So now in this year which is 2015 Nvidia's 970 users are noticing that a kind of a weird issue is going on even happening when they have monitoring the memory uses of the 970 during playing a game on 4k resolution even sometimes on 1080p but it's rarely happening in 1080p but in 4k it's massively memory drops are seen also fps drops too so this memory is kind of degrading like significantly it's showing 3.5 gigabyte of 4 gb which is 0.5 GB is kind of not utilizing or not even there. The problem is occurring when we are using memory more than the above the amount of it use. Then an NVIDIA's developer replied in the NVIDIA's forum of the people post of this problem which they have posted over there. So in that forum that the memory of the 970 he said that it is divided into two parts like 3.5 with an another 500 megabyte so he said that that the advertisement of the 970 which was given to the press wasn't accurate so it was mistakenly they have shown in case of 2048 kilobytes level of alto catch and 64 rop unit which is the specs of the 980 and the 972 which the press have shown but the real alto catch and the rope of the 970 is 1792 kilobytes of a level alto catch and 56 rop units so it is very low as compared to the press which they have sold so the real fact is it got a very first difference so along with that nvidia said that the reason of this incident is happened due to the communication error of the engineers and the technical pr team also it disables of a L2 ROP module. We can see this a diagram given by NVIDIA to PC perspective. So on the right hand side we can see the first L2 catch, I mean to say disable module and the others all are active. So only the right hand side right hand side first two got disabled because of the 4 GB VRAM it is to make I mean to say 3.5 GB of VRAM. So in case of a 980, we would have been seen the whole L2 catch module should be active, like it, it won't be disabled. So it is, it, I mean to say it gonna use the full 4GB in the 980 and in the 970 it should use 3.5GB of 4GB. So because of the disabling this thing happened. Because of this Maxwell architecture, the GPU is, that is why they can only disable two of the L2 catch module so if it would have been like Kepler then they would have disabled more than that but it's not possible in Nvidia's Maxwell architecture so they can only disable only two L2 catch module and make the others active so they can make a 4GB to 3.5 with a full speed basically an extra 500 megabyte which is obviously there but it can be only accessible at a slower speed but we won't gonna notice that 500 megabyte until it's used so if you play a game on 4k 
then only we can notice this uh, i mean to say about the vram issue because it will take the 500 megabyte as an extra uses for the memory okay guys now as i said i will show you the examples too so in the facts and the forums we have seen that only the middle art shadow of motor only that game only been pointed for this issue so we thought of making that as an example for you to make you understand the temperatures also the memory uses which it's taking so take a look at this Ok guys, basically for benchmarking this game, I have used the ASUS Trix Edition 970 Direct OC which is the overclock edition so you can see the 3.5GB of the memory uses it is not going forward than that 
in the tech gpu z so the fact is true it is not only happening with a shadow of motor it is also happening with various and other games too for if you want to see more testing and the benchmarking of various games then you can visit the pc perspective website they have nicely just described and also benchmark various games over there so i will link the url in the description so don't worry about that guys okay guys now i'm in my conclusion so if we ask ourselves or even others that do we really need that much of a vram or even more than that then you will basically get the answer of a no as a gaming as a gaming or even a gamer you can say so for gaming we don't even need like too much of vram 4 gigabyte or even less is sufficient at present and even for playing on 4k like if you are an average gamer and want to play on 10 any 1080p at present then it is sufficient of getting a 970 it's worth of getting a 970 for that resolution and if you want to just play every game on 4k only then you should get a 980 because that is a fully 4 gigabyte of vram and you can play 4k without any trouble and we don't need even more than 4 gigabyte of a vram because vram is based on for rendering stuff basically for a video production or even video editors you can say so it is used for that purposes so you don't need that much of vram so 980 is basically sufficient for playing on 4k as i said and for less than that you can just get a 970 970 is still an amazing card right now we can say also if we if you are just on your way to get a 970 and you are thinking of the vram issue then just leave it because nvidia is now on their way because many of the people have complained and they have listened also responded so they are now on their way to make a new driver or even a new firmware even that is upon them that they will just release a firmware or even a driver to fix this issue so they will just soon they're gonna just give us the driver and they will release it so if you are an average gamer then you can still get a 970 and if you want to play game i mean to say any game on 4k then you can just get a 980 so i hope you guys understand the whole thing of this video with the examples if you did then thumbs up for this video also share your comments and problems or even if you want any suggestion then let me know in the comments all right guys for more videos like this subscribe to my channel also share this video to your friends so this they can also understand if they're thinking of getting the 970 all right guys see you later in the next time then peace out